Welcome to On Point, your Polk News Beat for September 16th. Before we get started, make sure to subscribe to the channel and follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Here is your top headlines for this week. Anytime the Southwest Florida Water Management District releases an emergency final order for Polk County due to anticipated floods, roadway maintenance units across the county opens to the public to provide sandbags for residents. Each household will be able to take a maximum of 10 sandbags to help protect against water damage. When available, locations are open from 7 a.m. to 5.30 p.m. each day, including Sundays. On Wednesday, September 14th, the Polk County History Center hosted the Middle District of Florida United States District Court for Naturalization Ceremony. My fellow citizens of the United States, let me be the first to congratulate you and wish you all the best towards achieving your American dream for you and for your families. Good luck and God bless you all. 50 new citizens representing more than 20 different countries were administered the oath of allegiance and welcomed as United States citizens in front of their friends and families. Following the ceremony, new citizens were invited to join a celebratory reception hosted by the Bartow and Lakeland chapters of the Daughters of American Revolution and were encouraged to register to vote with the Polk County Supervisor of Elections Office. Polk County's latest of 17 new fire stations opened on September 15th. The newly built Lofman Fire Station is on Highway 1792 in Davenport. On behalf of the Polk Board of County Commissioners, I'd like to thank you for coming out to support the opening of this new station and support our first responders. The new stations have been designed to protect firefighters from carcinogens that had affected emergency workers in the past. And now you're on point with Polk County's top headlines this week. Before you go, please subscribe and give this video a like. On Point will be back with more headlines next week.